William Grimes, Anthony Johnson, and Boston King all had experiences in slavery. However, their particular circumstances uh, fairly were fairly different due to the periods of time they came from. Similar to King, but contrasting from Johnson, Grimes was born into slavery and remained a slave until he had an opportunity to escape. Whereas Johnson was only an indentured servant and was freed legally after a number of years serving. Although all three men had faced the cruelty of slavery, uh, their roads to freedom were pretty different. As I had mentioned, Johnson was only a servant and was made a free man a lot easier than Grimes and King. King, on the other hand, had to serve in the Civil War to earn his freedom, which even after was uh, continued to be threatened. And Grimes had to escape his master and head north to uh, for his freedom, and even after was recaptured and had to buy his freedom back from his master. So their differences and experiences are due to the historical changes that had taken place during their separate lifetimes. Johnson was enslaved in the 1620s. And in that time, slavery um, was very new in the colonies. So they had yet to establish uh, laws on race and slavery. Uh, so he was able to gain his freedom a lot easier that way. And, um, and he did not face quite the same level of racism that Grimes and King had. King was enslaved during the time of the American Revolution. So this worked in his favor because he was able to use the conflict between Britain and the colonies to gain his freedom by serving for the um, British army. Uh, Grimes was not as fortunate as these other two men, not to say that these men were fortunate at all in their lives, but Grimes was enslaved during the 1820s, which was a time where slavery and racism ran rampant through the United States, specifically in the South where slavery is deeply rooted and a lot of people, mainly obviously white plantation owners, felt that slavery was necessary. So this made gaining freedom a big struggle for Grimes. And in the end, he ended up poor and homeless for his freedom. So slavery and racial oppression have been around since the first Spanish colonists came to the Americas. But the structure and views on slavery and race had evolved greatly over the next couple centuries. So although Grimes, Johnson, and King were all African Americans who had been enslaved one way or another, their situations very much differed. <laughs>